Hey guys, I just wanted to make a quick video uh, updating you guys on a couple of things that are very important to this channel. As many of you know, in the past month or so, I have been living in Manjaro KDE on my main production machine. Uh, I had switched uh, operating systems on my main production machine. I decided to go with Manjaro, the KDE edition, mainly because I had never lived in KDE ever on any computer I've ever owned. So I've been giving Manjaro's KDE edition a try on my main production machine. And I've had some issues with it. Uh, I mean, I've been able to deal with it. I've, I've been living in it. I've been making videos in it. Uh, and to be honest, I could, I could continue using KDE forever if I wanted to. But to be honest, it's not behaving as I would like it to behave. I'm experiencing crashes. I'm experiencing some weird graphical glitches every now and then. Screen tearing, screen artifacts. Uh, had problems with the panel. Uh, the KDE panel was doing some weird things depending on what programs I was running. And you know, I'm just not used to to dealing with stuff like that. Uh, so you know what? I broke down about half an hour ago. I opened up a terminal here in Manjaro, Manjaro KDE, mind you, and I went ahead and sudo pacman dash capital S open box. I installed open box here on my Manjaro KDE install. Logged out of KDE, of course. Logged back in to the open box window manager, and I've spent the last 30 minutes or so uh, installing uh, themes and some of my old config files for open box. And basically, this is open box, guys. Uh, and I, I can tell you already, it's like a warm blanket. You know, you, it's like you put a warm blanket over me. I am so happy to be back in open box and to be done with that mess that was KDE. Uh, I still have KDE installed on this system. I still have the full KDE suite of apps and all that installed on this system. Probably within a couple of weeks, I'm going to do a clean wipe of this machine. I'm going to go ahead and install Manjaro. I'm going to do like a minimal install of Manjaro. And then I'm going to install OpenBox on top of Manjaro. But I wanted to, you know, test out open box before I, I just completely did a nuke and pave and, you know, reformatted the drive. So KDE is still on this system, but I went ahead and installed open box and uh, played around a little bit in the open box session. Again, maybe 30 minutes. That's an error because, you know, I pulled down my uh, old menu config here and uh, some of the programs in my open box menu are not installed yet here in Manjaro. I, I didn't bother installing all those programs, all the links to these programs in my open box menu here. But uh, open box just works. You know, I have no crashes. I have no weird graphical glitches. It just works. So I think this is where I'm going to end up. I'm just, I love, I love Manjaro. I didn't love KDE. You know, I love the arch base, I love the Pac-Man package manager, love everything about Manjaro, I love the community, I've been really impressed with everything about Manjaro, I can't live in KDE though, so I think this is where I'm going to end up uh, probably within a week or two, I'll let you you guys know when I actually do the real nuke and pave where I completely wipe out Manjaro KDE and I do the minimal install and build open box, I'll probably re record some of that too. So that's the first big announcement I wanted to share with you guys. You know, I thought that was important to share with you guys. The other thing I really wanted to share with you was, uh, again, this channel. I started this channel about three months ago, a little over three months ago, about three months ago, three and a half months or so. I think the first video I made was on October 8th of 2017. So three and a half months, maybe. And in three and a half months, we have officially crossed 1,000 subscribers. As of right now, I'm recording this video, I have 1,006 subscribers. 
Uh, what does that mean? Well, 1,000 is a nice round number. It's a nice milestone, and I'm very proud of that, especially to do that as quick as I've, I've been able to, to gather that many subscribers. And I wanted to really thank you guys. The other reason that milestone is important is a couple of uh, days ago I made a video about YouTube's new monetization policy, how you have to now have a thousand su subscribers on YouTube to qualify for monetization. I I'm going to be able to uh, to apply for that now. Uh, I, m I was already part of the program, but because they set those thresholds higher, they were actually going to terminate me from the program because I didn't have a thousand subscribers. But since I, I made a thousand subscribers here uh, before the new policy kicks into place, I won't be terminated. I won't be kicked out of their program. So that's kind of cool. Again, not that I was making any money from YouTube anyway. YouTube pays pennies. I mean, I, I make absolutely no money really on the ads, on my videos. Uh, a few bucks, you know. It's really all I make. So, but I, I'm really proud that I made a thousand subscribers in, in about three months. Uh, I'm really happy. Uh, the channel is just growing and growing, and I don't take that lightly. I know there's a lot of things I can improve on this channel. The uh, the quality of the videos, the quality of production. You know, I'm working with not that great equipment for one thing, uh, and a lot of you guys, you know, point out things that I could do to improve the channel. I want you guys to continue to point things like that out. Uh, now that I've actually made a thousand su subscribers, uh, I want to take this channel, you know, a little more serious because honestly, I made this channel again. I started this three months ago and I really didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know where I was going with this channel. I really didn't expect anybody to watch my videos. Um, now that so many people have taken interest and some of you have taken, you know, serious interest. I mean, I've got some of you that watch everything I put out, uh, that comment on all my videos, and uh, that means a lot to me. And I want to continue producing quality content for you guys. And not only producing quality content, but producing better content than what I've already been producing. Uh, again, I know I can improve on a lot of things, so uh, bear with me and share your thoughts. You know, if you've got... Uh, suggestions, uh, any kind of criticisms, I, I'm good with critique. I, I, I've got a thick skin. You're not going to hurt my feelings. So anything you guys uh, want to tell me as far as you know what to do as far as the channel moving forward, please share. But anyway, I want to thank you guys, uh, especially all you guys that have been subscribing. For those of you that have been watching the channel and haven't subscribed, uh, consider subscribing. Uh, it means a lot to me. It really does. Anyway, thanks guys. Peace.